you will see average questions on the SAT. The trick to these is to know the formula and when asked for more than one average, keep the averages straight. Let's go through an example. If the average of 32, 48, and x is 44, what is the average of x, 60, and 68? The formula for averages is simple. You add the numbers up and then divide by however many numbers you have in order to find the average. In this case, you know that 32, 48, and x gives you an average of 44. There are three numbers, so you add them up, you divide by 3, which is equal to 44. All you have to do now is solve for x. 32 and 48 is 80 plus x equals 132. x is equal to 52. Now, if you notice, one of the answer choices is 52. That's a distractor answer choice. Don't answer that. You're going to want to avoid making that careless error. You look at the rest of the question. They're asking you for the average of x, 60, and 68. Now is when you have to keep them straight. Write out an entirely different average. x you know to be 52. And then you have 60 and 68. It's a second average. You divide by the numbers that you have, which in this case are 3. This gives you 60, the average of 52, 60, and 68. Answer choice D, and you're done.